Hey, it's Joe Lyons from the Automator, and in this video, I'm going to show you some very simple code on how you can fix the Windows Clipboard Manager. Uh, this is built into Windows 10, and it's pretty cool on its own. However, for some reason, they, they have you hitting the space key in order to activate it, which drives me nuts. So I would much rather hit the uh, return key. So let me share my desktop here. You know, you can get this, the code I have here, not that it's a lot, but if you're lazy, and don't want to bother trying to type it out, you can go here to the automator slash fix clip and I'll make that download available. So let's jump into the code. Okay, so if you're not familiar with it, the built-in Windows tool, if you hit Windows V, it'll pop up. Now, if you haven't used it, it'll pop up and saying, hey, do you want to enable this? Just say yes. And you can go through, these are my past things I had on my clipboard. And let me show you here. So I'm going to go in and copy, I'm going to sit control C, just like you normal, control C and control C. So now, the last one was here, then it was, was, and then it was Joe. So when I hit Windows V, you'll see here was Joe, right, in the, the reverse order. And you can make them sticky, by the way. It's a cool tool. However, again, you have to, like, you can arrow up and down, but you have to hit the space bar to activate that thing, which to me is just not intuitive at all. So what I want to do is to be able to hit the Enter key. So what I have it set up now is when I hit Windows V, I can select what I want and hit Enter. And it, what auto hotkey is doing is it sends the space key instead. And that is accomplished by this little bit of code here. Now this, this just, if you have it on your own script, the single instance force is a good one to have there. The next one is a no environment it just says, Hey, let's, let's not take these variables. It's a good default setting. Now here, this is saying if the active window is this shell light dismiss overlay, Right, so I don't know if this class is used anywhere else, but it seemed pretty rare to me. So it's it's probably very stable. If this is active, when I hit the enter key, and this is where you would change this hotkey to whatever you want, uh, then I'm gonna send the space key, right? And then just return to stop it from going forward. So auto hotkey is amazing to just remap keys in Windows. It's a really great tool. So uh, please uh, like this video and share, comment if you find something interesting or you want to change that key to something else. But this is a nice, simple way to make that tool much more functional. Cheers.